Hello, uh, my name is Joe, and uh, what you see before you is the futon set I recently purchased through uh, Mr. Nohara via MustLoveJapan.com. Um, essentially, what's included with the set uh, that I purchased was the uh, mattress futon that you see here, um, a coverlet futon. Go over. Um, I have the mattress base that the mattress futon will uh, rest upon. And uh, though it's you can purchase it extra, I also got a pillow. So, as discussed, uh, I was provided uh, two covers, one for the mattress futon and one for the coverlet futon. At first glance, um, one might think that the larger one here would be for the uh, mattress futon, which uh, in its folded state is actually larger. However, that's in fact not the case, contrary to what I thought. Um, and in fact, the smaller one is actually associated with the mattress futon, and the larger one is for storing the cover. Side. And actually, there's a zipper seam, so that would indeed be what I'm looking for. Sorry. And in fact, there's the zipper, which goes down the entire line. Uh, one important thing to uh, note is that uh, with these futons, the side that your feet are aligned to are typically marked with uh, the tag here. So obviously when it gets in storage, um, you know, you're not going to be able to see which end is which. But when you take it back out, as far as orienting it um, goes, the tag will be at the uh, side of your feet. Alright, so the easiest way to, to do this is kind of as displayed here, where you take the uh, cover, go ahead and lay it out lengthwise, that way the orientation that the mattress futon is supposed to go in will be uh, more intuitively obvious um, for you. orientation is correct and that you can actually close the futon as you can see I'm marked with the tag side so this will be down towards the feet and um, you can mark it however you like and once it's in it is a fairly delicate zipper on the uh, covering so don't uh, don't horse around or uh, go too hard as you can see a little bit of Playing around, you can get it to fit uh, nice and smoothly in the, in the case. Uh, coverlet futon also came on the cover, so preparation of that will be the, uh, the next step. And uh, if there's ever you know any confusion again as to which cover goes with what, um, you can see that the cover for the coverlet futon actually has a uh, fine meshing, which the mattress futon uh, did not cover, did not have. So once again, right. Um, when you order the futon, uh, you'll have a choice of uh, pattern to get. Obviously the pattern will be displayed um, and the surface that you're going to uh, sleep next to will be unadorned and plain. So. Upon opening the coverlet futon out, you can see why the cover is actually required to be much larger for this particular piece. And then again, as with the mattress futon, it's just all about finessing the cover so that you can get it situated properly. And then as you wrap up, 
Make sure your edges are nice and flush. So you're not going to pinch the coverlet. Run it properly. And that is the installation of the coverlet futon into its cover. So additionally with the uh, set an option that you have is to uh, have a custom made pillow um, to match with your uh, futon set. Uh, I had one ordered um, and it was uh, provided by Mr. Nohara. As far as uh, orientation goes, uh, with the mattress futon we discussed a tag. However, with the pillow you can see a little indentation here, um, which is actually where the base of your neck is supposed to rest. Um, for the pillow construction, uh, measurement was actually taken. Um, this pillow is specifically, in this case, designed for uh, for my dimensions, and uh, it's going to be super comfortable. So. I realize that it's uh, taking a while to get the cover on. However, you don't want to force it into the cover too much because it will uh, then upset the distribution of padding in the pillow and kind of ruin the whole custom made pillow concept. So. And voila. And as was discussed, the uh, down portion, you can feel the indentation with your hands. So it's identifiable. Assembly of the whole the whole futon set so that I can have a peaceful night's sleep at some point. Um, so as discussed, uh, have a mattress that the mattress futon will uh, sit upon so that serves as your base. Um, helps to protect the mattress from moisture coming up from the ground and also provides it a solid base upon which to rest. So unlike the uh, other pieces, um, as far as which side they use for the uh, base mattress, and kind of go with uh, either one, they're more or less equivalent. So, but uh, orient your mattress however you're going to be sleeping. And as discussed uh, with the mattress futon, one must always be mindful of where the tag is. You can still make it out through the cover, so we know that this is down. And if I move on, lay down your coverlet futon. And again, remember the nape for orientation of your of your pillow. And uh, be sure, whenever you do sleep at night, anyhow, that the uh, edge of your pillow doesn't basically fall off the edge of your uh, mattress futon. Otherwise, it won't really be a very comfortable experience for you. So just keep the edges pretty flush. And. Uh, that's assembly of your futon set. So, I'm gonna go to sleep now, but y'all take care. Uh, just like floating on air. No, seriously, good night. <laughs>